Welcome back, and today I'll be seeing Notts County take on Accrington Stanley in League 2. Now, Notts County have had a brilliant start to the season and have been really impressed with their tactics and the new players that have been in the squad. Of course, it's still early in the season, so we don't know how long they can keep this up, but nonetheless, it's a really promising start. Another thing to note before we get into the vlog is that I don't think that Jody Jones will be playing today, which is a sore miss, but hopefully it will give some other players some good opportunities to get into the squad and prove themselves. The weather conditions weren't perfect for the game, but we made our way into the ground. And before the game was kicked off, a tribute was paid to Sven Goran Eriksson due to his role as the former director for Notts County. And Knotts had a fast start after kickoff with a decent chance early on. County didn't really challenge the goal all that much, but they dominated possession and compared to last season, they were still a lot better. And David McGoldrick scored an absolute screamer to go ahead around 20 minutes in. His goal was very similar to the first one he scored against Swindon last week. He had some more decent chances later on in the half as well. Accrington also had a decent chance after a Knotts mistake but the keeper, Alex Bass, did really well in goal. Knotts didn't really have too many chances in the first half, and when they did, they were tough ones to score from. However, the first half ended 1-0 to County. Then McGoldrick kicked off the second half for Knotts. Soon after though, Knotts nicked a goal, however, it was disallowed by the referee. And the first big chance of the half came when the Accrington keeper made two great saves to deny a second goal for Knotts. And McGoldrick got his double for the Magpies when his shot was deflected into the net. 2-0 Later on Knotts had some great opportunities one from substitute Kedwin Scott who missed the goal there are also three players that stood out to me during the game, other than man of the match, David McGoldrick. Abbott, the loney from Spurs, Curtis Edwards and Badeau. Abbott looked sharp and he won back the ball in midfield a lot. Edwards was absolutely everywhere and his work rate was really good. And Badeau was extremely solid at the back and did well going forwards as well. And after a long eight minutes of added time, the match ended 2-0 to Knotts to move them up to second in the league table. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.